did you know that our Restore is mainly run on the help of volunteers? So I'm going inside to find out a little bit more about what makes the volunteer experience such a good one. Follow me. Well, I'm here with Gordon Sheriff, one of our star volunteers who's working here in the yard. Hi, Gordon. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you. Now, Gordon, I wanted to ask you, what was it that inspired you to come and take a volunteer role at the ReStore? Well, I'm a bit of a tinkerer and I was always here digging around looking for parts for things and whatnot like that. And I also hate waste. So I come here to try, try and alleviate that. Let's not waste things. Oh, I love that. That's such an important, important role that we have here at the ReStore. And so what is it about working? Because your, your job, your role is working out in the yard, correct? So yeah. what is it about working out here that made you stick around, that excites you, that brings you to work? Well, every day is Christmas around here. You never know what you're going to find. You know, it's, it's really one of the few stores in town where you don't know the stock. You know, every day you find something different and some different stuff comes in every day. I love that. I love that. It's always exciting. I find that too. Now, what would you tell other prospective uh, volunteers who are curious about working at the ReStore? What would you tell them? Well, you're doing a world of a lot of good when you come here because all this stuff would otherwise go to landfill and uh, it doesn't and it makes money. How can you lose? Exactly. Win both ways. Yes, it's a win-win. Well, yes. thank you so much, Gordon. Yes. Thank you so much for all your help. I, yes. should, I should say I look upon my job here as a landfill avoidance technician. Exactly. A brand title. And we need more of those. Yes, <laughs> Amazing, Gordon. We'll have a great day. Thank and you. to all you prospective volunteers out there, come on, see what we have here. We have so many amazing opportunities. And now's the time. Bye-bye.